we've been fostering about nine years. Um, we've had uh, short-term and long-term children, uh, about 20 of them. You saw them develop from little babies and we kept two or three of them, three or four of them from naught day one to they were about a year and they got adopted on. So um, we could see that they, they were going to be happy children. Because we were introduced to the other foster carers and the Foster Carers Association as an umbrella that's been the mainstay, I would say, of, of, of us. And now, because we've, we've got the, the, the years under our belt, we've actually become maybe the ones that are looking after the other foster carers rather than the other way around. So um, that's, one of the, that's one of the motivations for me, to be fair, um, is to be part of that community and help people along and see, see where we can go with it. I don't think it's enough just to sort of say, we got a bed, we got a room, you can come and stay. I don't think that's quite what it's about. That's like having a B and B. That's not what it's about. And it's a bit of a hackneyed um, comment, but it is opening your heart up rather than your door. And I think if you can't open up your heart to it, then might be best not to do it. Um, but if you can, it's probably of all the jobs I've, and let's call it a job for now, of all the jobs I've had, it's probably been the most rewarding, I have to say. You know, in terms of, and I've had a few jobs. <laughs> um, I've had maybe three careers. And this, although this is my wife's career, um, I'm an equal partner. And it has been overall very, very positive and very, very enjoyable. And you learn, you learn about yourself, funnily enough. You, you learn what thresholds you've got. Um, and you learn, off, you learn certain things that probably you would never have thought of. And that goes back to actually, funnily enough, the foster carers. The other foster carers are probably, in fairness, your best source of information. Because a social worker can tell you, but a foster carer can show you. And I, I would, if I was asking, saying to someone, being a foster carer, and I have spoken to quite a lot of people about it, I've always said, join the Foster Care Association as soon as you can, because that's where you'll get the font of knowledge which other people wouldn't have, frankly.